I got you. Like a high taper? Okay. And you still want like the shape up around here and stuff? Yeah. Got you. Cool. Let's do it. All right, YouTube. Today I worked a miracle. I don't know how I did this. But when he came in, I was like, we're going to have to do something. We're going to have to do something. So I'm going to start by pinning up his hair. This is a part of the free haircut series. If you are interested in getting a haircut and you don't want to drop $100 on it, hey, I get it. Wolf your hair out and come through. Your payment is the video, and I'm cool with that. Redeemable once, and yeah, I think that's fair. So, very simple haircut today. Not really much explaining to do, except when it comes to the hairline. As you can see, he's missing hair on his hairline. This is just through the genetics and time. So we're just gonna give him a high taper. He didn't want any C cups. Now, only tip I can give you, just be careful you don't cut into the braids or the dreads or whatever. Don't don't do that. Because and, and you're most likely to do this on a client like this who hasn't gotten a retwist or, or rebraided in a while. That's when you're most likely because all that new growth peaks out. I always tell people always get it retwisted before the barber or rebraided before the barber. Um, that way, if you when you do have the new growth, your braider or your, your lactician will take that new growth and put it into the longer hair. So always remember that. We're barbers, we just cut, you know what I'm saying? We just chop things down, we just cut. We, You know, I'm calculated, but a lot of other barbers are really not. They just chop down whatever hair they see. Um, so we're gonna do the same thing to this side. Just debulking it with the one. And he wanted his beard faded in without taking any length off, even though I thought we should have, but he didn't really want no length off. So right now I'm debulking the back. All right, so before we line up anything, I'm gonna trim down those hairs. That way to line up makes more sense and it's, it's more manageable for me and for him. What you do to one side, you don't always have to do to the other side, but typically you do. Now the purpose of this video is to show you that it is possible to give your client what they want, you know? I mean, he wasn't looking for crazy enhancements, he just said just a little bit. I'm gonna start in the middle, keeping it just right where it's at. Honestly, just giving him a ghost line. I call this a ghost line. You're not trying to give him a hairline because obviously it's very thin, but you want to make it appear as if he does have one. And in the corners, he'll have his hairline, but in the middle, 
it's pretty thin so make a make a quick ghost line match it up with the vertical bars now match it up with the other side So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray uh, just a tad bit of enhancements on the ghost line. More in the corners. I'm gonna spray more enhancements in the corners, but a little bit in the front, mainly in the corners. This is gonna give him the appearance that he has a full hairline. And it's gonna make the cut look good. So right here, just a little bit, and I'm spraying it far back than what I usually do. Just a dash. Now I'm gonna just shape up um, his beard. And for the bottom of the neck, I don't like to keep it too natural. You do have to take it back. Um, not to their jawline, but usually right below it to give them the appearance that um, their neck has a beard also, you know? Right now I'm using my Easy Blade Shaving Razor. Use my Cold the 4th Ken for 10% off. Also, any other brands that you guys are interested in, um, I also have discount codes with some of them. Check it down in the uh, description below. And we're dry shaving, just stretching the skin. I'm gonna just clean up his forehead with the trimmer. Sometimes you could leave away a lot of uh, just loose hairs that fall down. And my client was satisfied. He, he said it was exactly what he wanted. He wasn't looking for nothing too, too crazy. Just a quick cleanup. So this is how he came in. And this is how he's leaving. A nice, clean ghost line. I think it came out dope. New to the channel, you know what to do. It's your boy 4 and I'm out. Peace.